Hello guys, Colin here. This is the Rocker 15 Terror from Orange Amplification, a compact lunchbox amp and the latest in the Terror range. This thing has tone for days and is likely all you ever need for the majority of rock scenarios, be it at home or on stage. So let's take a listen and dig a little deeper into the features. has two channels, Natural, which is Orange's clean channel, and Dirty, where all the hairy distortion wonderment can be found. It has four different power options to help dish out that cranked tone at volume levels appropriate for your situation. Headroom offers 15 watts or 7 watts, perfect for band practices or smaller live shows, and Bedroom offers 1 watt or half a watt so you can get all that juicy goodness without upsetting the neighbours. Taking a look at some of the channel features then. Natural is simply a single volume control. The EQ is set internally for this channel and dialed a little bit brighter than other Orange Clean channels, correcting some user complaints that Orange Clean channels can typically be a little bit dark. Combining this with the valve buffered effects loop gives us a wonderfully vibrant channel, which is a great canvas for all your effects to paint on. has some more flexibility with a three band EQ, bass, middle and treble, and the all important gain control which has incredible range, going from sizzling cleans through classic rock crunch and into saturated hard rock and old school metal territory. Like the natural channel, this too loves pedals and pushing the amp with a tube screamer opens up even more tonal options. <laughs> Thank you. 
while it's possible to get some classic British metal tones out of this thing, it's not so accepting of modern metal sounds. It just isn't that sort of gain structure, so if you're looking for your next high gain death metal amp, this isn't it. The Rocker 15 has a range of speaker outputs so that you can run any 8 or 16 ohm cabinet of your choice, shown here with my custom Hof 9 8 ohm Pro 212V which complements this amp perfectly. There is a foot switch connection for channel switching, but frustratingly, the foot switch isn't included with the amp. I imagine this is an aid of keeping the RRP under the magic number of 550 Great British Pounds, but it would simply be more useful if this was included instead of having to buy it as an extra. For those interested in what's going on under the hood, this thing is cooking two EL84 power valves, perfect for getting those saturated distortion tones at low volumes, and three ECC83s and an ECC81 in the preamp. That's 12AX7 and 12AT7 respectively, if you're from a country who calls these things tubes. The robust metal chassis will take all the abuse of the road, while still being small and light enough to transport between gigs easily. It even comes with a fitted gig bag for extra protection while in transit, so you can just sling this amp over your shoulder and swagger off into the sunset like the rock star cowboy that you are. I just want to say thanks to Orange Amplification for sending me this amplifier to make videos with. It might just be my new favourite amp and chances are I won't be sending this one back. If you liked this video and you want to see more content from me, then you can hit that subscribe button and it will notify you of all new content as it comes out. My Patreon's also there for exclusive secret stuff if you wish to support me further and there's other videos you might not have seen. But that's all for now guys, keep it loud and I will see you later.